Hello and welcome, my name is Daisy. In today's tutorial, I will show you how to add offset to text and images using the free graphic design program Inkscape. First, I will show you how to add offset to text. Click on the A on the left, click on the canvas and start typing. Click on the top arrow, resize it using the arrows around the text. I'm going to use a different font. I'm going to select the text. Then I'm going to click on the T on the right or on text on the top and select text and fonts. You will be able to see this list on the right. Scroll down until you find the font of your liking. Now, if you already know the name of the font you wish to use, click on the top left corner and type the name of the font. The font I am using today is called Ardila. This font is from Creative Fabrica. I'm going to link it in the video description down below. Select the text, go to Path, and click on Object to path. Now go to object and click on ungroup. Keep it selected, go back to path and click on union. Now we are going to add the offset. Select the text, go to path and click on linked offset. Go to the color palette, select the color for the offset, click on the second arrow from the top and you will be able to see this little diamond on top of the text. Click on the magnifying glass and make the text bigger. Click on the second arrow now click on the little diamond and stretch it to the outside to create the offset. Go to the bottom right corner to make the canvas smaller. There is the text with the offset. You may leave it like that or you may add another offset if you wish. Click on the border, click on the top arrow, go to path and click on link offset. Click on the second arrow, pick the color, Click on the little diamond and stretch it to the outside. Now that you already know how to add offset to text, I'm going to show you how to add offset to images. I will use this JPEG image. This image has a white background. I'm going to remove it first so I can add border. Remember, we have to vectorize the images to be able to add offset. Select the image, go to Path, click on Trace Bitmap, and you will see this window on the right. Select on Single Scan, click on Update Preview, and click on apply and here is the vectorized image you may erase the one on the bottom we're not going to need it anymore now we're going to add the offset select the image go to path click on linked offset pick the color Click on the second arrow from the top to find the little diamond. 
click on the magnifying glass, click on the little diamond to make the image bigger, click on the second arrow again, click on the little diamond and stretch it to the outside to create the offset. Click on the bottom right corner to make the canvas smaller. And there is the image with offset. The offset has some holes that do not look good, but don't worry, I will show you how to fix it. Select the offset, go to path, and click on object to path. Now click twice on the image and you are going to be able to see those little squares around the image. Now you're going to select the little squares around the holes and delete. It looks much better. You may leave it like that or you can keep on adding offset. Now you already know how to add offset to text and images using Inkscape. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and if you have any questions feel free to comment below this video. And please don't forget to support my channel by subscribing, liking, commenting and by pressing the notification bell. Thank you for your visit and I'll see you in my next tutorial.